hear about Los Angeles and there's good rates, and so they're able to come out and they're able to be tourists. You know, sometimes for the first time, people are able to come out to California, visit the weather, and um, one of the things that becomes really popular are these uh, various farms that begin to kind of pop up. Um, ostrich farms, alligator farms, and then zoos. And there as was well. a lion farm in El Monte, too. Yeah, oh, yeah it's okay. weird stuff like that, you know. Something in and how did that shake the ostrich? Um, just because of the yeah. way that, you know, it, 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 you know, thousands of people would actually visit these places, and sometimes, this is a really interesting fact, is that around Griffith Park, there was um, an ostrich farm. Mm -hmm. And do you know when you're driving in between Silver Lake and Echo Park, mm -hmm. and you drive through that area that looks like it's been cut out? Right before you yeah. hit Mohawk, you know, and the Oh, you right made the there. junction? Um, uh, no, a little bit after Sunset Junction. Mm -hmm. um, but when you're driving yeah. up that hill to okay. Echo Park, mm -hmm. um, you go through an area that looks like it's been, that was actually put in place because um, there was a railroad, the Ostrich Railroad, which actually ran from downtown into this off this ostrich farm, and it eventually became Sunset Boulevard, you know. Oh. And so, uh, just the way that you know people use the land, I guess, and the way that um, infrastructure is such that you know there were so many people visiting these things that they actually thought that it would be profitable to build a special railroad for people to come out and Where see it. Where was that know? ostrich farm? In Griffith Park. In Griffith Park. Yeah. yeah. I'm yeah. surprised that they left them. I know South Pasadena, but I didn't know. Well, it was before part. that it was a. It was park. before the Griffith. Yeah. Oh, it was before. before. I think oh. that Griffith maybe have had like it was talked about in this. Um, there's a wonderful series on KCET. You know, the public. Uh, KCET. Yeah, 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 yeah. They do this thing called LA is Subject. I think it's called. Oh, is that right? Um, and it's a uh, it's a uh, ongoing kind of examination of different things in Los Angeles history, and one of them is the history of Griffith Park, and it talks oh, about nice. this ostrich farm that's there, so yeah, I can, I can send that to... What is the KCET yeah. number? You know, I Do you don't know? know, I've just been using the website, but um, but yeah, I mean, I, you could probably get it from... Because on the TV, I, I don't recall if I've always run into KCET. Oh, it is it PBS? I know PBS. Mm, just yeah. Google, just Google. Yeah, What's it called again? LA is subject. LA is subject, yeah. LA is subject. From the objects that are surrounding you in this area, um, if you had cattle during this time, um, you were really well off because you could buy imported sewing chests from China. Um, you could buy you know, very finely crafted writing desks. These tortoiseshell combs were extremely popular amongst the ladies of the refinement. And it's interesting because we actually have a receipt that says on this receipt that um, you know, a gentleman, uh, you know, paid, Avila gave Stern six cow hides and promised 12 more to complete the sale, okay? So the entire economic structure of the Los Angeles area was resting on cows, okay? And that's a big thing that we, you know, really want to stress right here. So it was all based on cows, but politically and, you know, naturally things began to change. And so that's where we see this next area over here. to feed, you know, these engines, you know, because you're burning a lot of gas. We had both in Southern California and Los Angeles area. And then, you know, along with the uh, good weather, we also have a vibrant industrial base that begins to form, you know, starting in the Depression, we have some government uh, investment in the area, but really what happens is when, when we go to war, World War II, um, that completely explodes, okay? So suddenly, because Los Angeles is one of the larger areas with on the West Coast, um, we're beginning to supply all sorts of economic goods to the uh, U.S. Army, the Marine Corps, all these different people. Um, you know, begin to use the organization to begin using us. Um, so we have some, you know, uh, represented with a, a helmet right here, a welding mask, a poster, um, and then this, you know, aircraft engine. So this is the kind of mechanical side of the war. Um, and on this side, the 
these gentlemen, yes, the first got. Well, and 